Thank you very much, Richard. And now, uh, last but not least, we, we have um, uh, an hero uh, in the person of Valeria Novella who brought this uh, exceptional team of, uh, let's say so, young shipowners, but they're already very <laughs> And an old man, <laughs> Almost like young. me, Almost or even young. more, uh, it looks. Uh, with Carlo Cameri, we, um, when um, Paolo D'Amico had this unexpected commitment, he said, but there is Carlo, uh, is, uh, better than me. He didn't he said, know what so. he was saying, but anyway. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. I, we do really appreciate that there are very, very, quite a few survivors tonight here, yeah? and to thank you for this. We were not going, Valeria and I decided not to make any introductory speak, speech. And um, also because someone said we should talk about tanker market, and really, talking about tanker market, we would close the conference in a really depression mode, mood, and this would not be very nice from Francesco Lauro, who kindly invited us here. So we will uh, immediately introduce the speaker. We have one speaker and three panelists, and we introduce the speaker who is uh, David McInnes. David McInnes, he was here last year as well, is very well known to you. He's a partner with Ins and Co in London. He has a broad practice covering most areas of shipping law, particularly P&I and Holland machinery insurance litigation. David speaks uh, fluent Italian and has been a leading member of INS and Co's Italy team for a number of years. He is also a regular contributor to the English law section of Diritto and Trasporti. Legal Business Magazine, some times ago, but we don't say how long ago, named David as one of the top 30 under 30 lawyers in the UK, and he has been involved in a number of reported shipping law cases. Uh, and our panelist, uh, I'm introducing the lady panelists we have tonight. Uh, Mariella Bottiglieri unfortunately apologizes but she had to leave and she is uh, Francesca Barbaro uh, who after having become a qualified lawyer and after having spent approximately seven years in English law firms both in Italy, well, in, in law firms both in Italy and UK in the shipping finance department joined her family business in 2008 as general manager of PB Tankers SPA. She's also vice president of the Young Ship Owners Group of Confitarma. Thanks Carlo. I'm pleased to introduce Mr. Antonio Ciocchi. He had worked for 15 years in uh, Texaco manager before joining Muship's group in the office around the world. He is now managing director of the cargo division in Monaco, looking after a large fleet both for technical and crewing uh, services. Then I am pleased to introduce Giovanni Gavarone. He started his career as a broker, tanker broker in 2000 in Genoa and Bancosta. Then he moved to London, joined Hedmar Group. Become, becoming a quick time managing director of Dorado Tanker Pool. Then he moved back to Genoa, to Bancost again, where he is now a tanker broker uh, dedicated to charter and department. So thanks everybody. And um, as Carlo said, we should spend a lot of time speaking about uh, energy market, but with the aim of Mr. our speaker, Mr. David, uh, we will focus our attention on the vetting issues, which is a very delicate and also important theme for all of us. Thanks. 